I started making movies when I was, gosh, 15. Uh, my sister was on a travel hockey team. I'd been writing movie review posts for a, a blog and then for a local newspaper. And um, I got a camcorder because my parents were like, hey, she likes movies, so that's the next logical step. And so I started following uh, my sister's hockey team around. And um, for six months, I shot all their games, did interviews with people, and um, kind of that evolved into a documentary. So the next project that I did was a short documentary on a summer camp that I'd attended that was a really unique place called the Sun Foundation. Um, and they bring in artists and scientists from across the United States to a uh, place in rural Illinois and they teach kids their trades. And, um, and that place was very meaningful to me and I wanted to kind of convey that to other people and so that got on PBS in central Illinois. I see the light in you. You see the light in me. Together we shine. This entire world is based on that. If we can just make our light our own responsibility, do the best that we can do, and we share that with the next person that we see, and we try to see the beauty in them, together we shine. And we walk around the world lighting the place up. Thing that I love is editing documentaries. I love sitting down with you know 50 to 100 you know to several hundred hours of footage and and sorting through things and picking out the little bits that are meaningful and exciting and um, and putting those together in a way that tells a story. This is an ordinary town and the prophet stands apart. This is an ordinary town and we broke no way. So many people look at this, it should have been bulldozed. You destroy these buildings, you destroy a connection. Rock of ages, love contagious, shine the serpent fire.